โอเคสวัสดีครับโอเค this is my first time uploading a HD video to my YouTube channel uh, because I see my YouTube quite uh, quite a while have haven't upload anything yet uh. so in my own page in my own Facebook page m u n g k o n c h o k I actually tell everybody that I be, I'm gonna upload something uh, that has some value lah. Huh? a g a a g a got some value that, that 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 can reach out to more. So this this video, I'm going to share the kata, that means the mantra to chant, uh, so called to invoke, uh, pra t a w e s u w a n t a w e s u w a n Um, Tawe Suwan is a uh, is so called. He is in charge of the realms of the spirit, realms of spirit or uh, so called ghost or demons. Or he is the so called king, the ruler of them all. So he is in charge of this realm. h uh, in Chinese we call Gui Wang, or the king of the ghost or something like that. h uh, so, but he also believed to bestow wealth. Actually, last year, Tawet Suwan was very strong. In Thai, they call man Tawet Suwan Malang, Payana ko Malang. Malang means it, 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 this is the very strong year for Lord Tawet Suwan. So, uh, actually, you don't have to have a bucha. You don't have to have a a, a, a worship. Uh, you know, a, a statue to worship. Or, or even have an amulet to to wear to chant the mantra. They believe that if you chant the mantra at least like, uh, usually we go at least one time lah. You go by odd number one three five seven nine. So the it say that if you chant a daily night time, it might give you protection, and even improve your so called wealth and luck. How improve ah? I don't know whether he'll bestow you or not. Huh? That one up to your. Your your fortune, whether it holds such a, uh, it has such miracles for you, you know? So in anyway, the t a w e t s u a n uh, it is believed to bestow wealth. h uh, I think in other culture, it is also said to be, uh, the god of wealth. h uh, in different culture, because in every every different culture, it is depicted in a very different manner. Okay. Like in Tibet or in other places like Chinese, is depicted in various forms. Just just like Buddha in Myanmar, Buddha is 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 depicted in in, in another in their own cultural art form. In Thailand, is you know the usually the g r i d is sharp, or in Chinese usually is the Amitabha style. So, uh, and then t a w e t s u a n also have Song Pang. He has two manifestation. One is the Number one is the Pang Na Teip. Na Teip, I think many of you doesn't know. He he doesn't have the sharp razor fangs and looks looks like a demon or demonic being. He actually have an angelic face. Um, the one we call Pang Na Teip, huh? And then another one is the usual we every we everyone everyone knows. Uh, he the very. Fierce demonic face with the two fangs judging up, and then with the t a b o n g Sometimes you can see he he has the manifestation of sikon. Sikon kon is hand. Sikon means four hands. How it depends. And then usually it's just holding the t a b o n g or the the big huge stick. How usually is holding just the t a b o n g This called the t a b o n g Oh, and then some is in the man in in the face of the na t a p e It means the angelic face. Or na yak, yak to see it means the giant, giant demonic face, h uh, So probably the one is to give protection, h uh, So in my own interpret interpretation, uh, the na yak is for protection. He scares or scares off all, uh, uh, all these uh, so-called demonic or harmful beings that 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 come near us, h uh, With malicious intent. Uh, the my own interpretation, ah. Uh, That means the angelic face is supposed to give us wealth, <laughs> but anyway, anyway, this is just my own thinking, lah. So if you want the kata, oh, uh, I will show you the the pang, uh, na na yak and this, the number one I show you is the pang na t e p Okay. 
好、哦、，then after that I will show you the Nayak. Sorry, sorry, Nayak. Okay. Okay, so you have seen the nut head, huh? Now you shall you shall see the the usual style. You see, uh, Tan Tao Wei is in most temple is in the form manifestation of the nut yak. The giant yak means giant, the giant demonic with the two fangs, very scary face. Okay, so there is a two uh, so-called song bang, the two manifestation of uh, Tawet Suwano. Uh, and then the next uh, I'll be sharing with you if is the kata. Now the kata is um, uh, if you try to remember it by heart, it shouldn't be difficult. Uh, I I the, the the pronunciation and the wording should be at least ninety percent accurate for me. Uh, it might be some there, there might be some discrepancy. Uh, because sometimes the accent they use and we use is a bit different uh, but it doesn't matter uh, it doesn't really, it's just like namo tatsa the thai use namo tatsa but the indian they use namo tatsa so it's it's just the same huh? anyway we don't really understand what it means because it's pasa pali it's pali language uh, it's not thai language huh? any mantra all this uh, um, most uh, most kata is actually the ancient indian pali language uh, not sanskrit uh. Sanskrit is used by the Mahayana. In Theravada, we follow. We are more use. We are more to Pali, oh, Pali. Now the the kata, uh, you can chant any time. Sometimes you go to those uh, maybe Lulu areas, uh, cold, secluded areas. Uh, you can actually use the kata. You can use the full kata, or you can use the Heart mantra. That means the huo jai, huo jai. That means the 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 short form of the whole kata, which is wait sa put sa. Later I'll explain. Oh, let's let listen to the kata first, and then you you can grab shot the. I'll I'll give you the wordings. You can grab shot, and then you can try to remember from the from I from me pronouncing the kata also. Okay, okay here we go. Kata tao wei su wan. Itipiso pakawa, yama prachano, tawe suwano, maranang sukang, ahang sukato, na moputaya, tawe suwano, jatu maha ratika, yaka panta, papu rito, we sa putsa putang, arahang puto, tawe suwano, na moputaya. Okay, so, um, Remember, uh, as 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 with all usually and most mantras or most kata, so now um, usually we just have to chant. Uh, we have to go homage for homage to Buddha first, which is Namo Tassa, uh, but not Namo Tassa three times. Uh, it's Namo Tassa Pakawato Arahato Samma Samputasa three times. This is paying homage to Lord Buddha, and then we chant the kata. Uh, um, this one, whoever don't know, you can just go to my page and message me, or you can just drop a message in my in my YouTube channel. Huh? You can drop a message there. Uh, I also need you all to give me more ideas of what videos to to, to create, or to to share more of these knowledges. Huh? Instead of listening to bullshit outside, huh? um, highly superstitious, uh, untrue stuff. Oh, so I would like you all to give me some ideas of what to do, what videos to do also. I was thinking the next video I'm going to do the kata nang kuak. Oh, that one is for wealth and mahasane. Oh, mahasane, yeah, sane. Oh, sane to improve your, your businesses or your daily work whatsoever. Oh, so in an event where, you know, let's say, uh, let's say uh, you're in a 
hospital alone and then you start to feel tingly tingly you are scared or maybe you really you know you sway I really saw something not normal lah. I don't want to use the word paranormal so you can actually uh, in your mind you can actually think of your own Lung Pu Lung Pao your own master whoever you're worshipping or you can actually think of the face of the face of Pao Wei Suan you, you, you try and picture him in your mind and you chant Wei Sa Pu Sa this is the heart mantra Kata Hua Jai Pao Wei Suan No Wei Sa Pu Sa in the in, in the in the in the Kata Jatu Maha Ratika this is the level this is the heavenly level where he came from Tao Wei Suan No came from Tao Wei Suan No resides in the heavenly realms in, 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 in all these things they, they say that the have there's many uh, level of heavenly realm huh? even Man uh, Maya the one the demon who come and stop Buddha from gaining enlightenment he also resides in one of the heavenly realms but it's not down there one, it's not hell one uh, huh? so the the Chan so, Chan Sawan where uh, Tao Wei Suan no recite is called Jatu Maha Ratika huh? so if in case you all you know go to hotel room suddenly the TV kaki kui or turn on by itself the the you know the water tut 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 tut, you you lampa your your balls a bit string uh, so you can just think of Tao Wei Suan huh? then you chant Wei Sa Put Sa you just keep chanting Wei Sa Put Sa this is the heart mantra of Tao Wei Suan okay so uh, can you get more people to subscribe to my channel so I can know what to do what what other videos to do so um drop me a comment i want to know what video would you all like to see oh to to, to what 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 information that we all like to know regarding uh, amulets from thailand oh, some of the basic kata i can share uh, the etp so all this is quite long uh, uh, ETP so China Banchon all this is very good kata China Banchon is best you can actually you are actually invoking all the arahang to come and give you protection okay to put you in the victor's cage so drop me a comment and thank you for your time sabadikha